Good morning. We're doing some concrete work today. Getting the truck loaded up. We've got all this stuff. And all that stuff. And that thing. We've got the water tank filling. All this stuff. <laughs> all that stuff. Yeah. We like doing concrete. We're doing a half of a, an approach at a house we had a main break six months ago or so i don't know it's time to get it put back in there we don't do a lot of concrete but we enjoy it oh my gosh i thought somebody that? screwed that into the fuel tank that would have been great what are we talking about now about the air hose air hose i thought somebody just screwed this uh nice little grabber into the side of the fuel tank but that's not the fuel tank that ain't the fuel tank <laughs> that would have been great that's just a fender yeah i wonder who that somebody is i don't know <laughs> look at that seat belt's already eating through that jump uh, well i have to get my grandma to sell it yeah she mother know how to sew boom jump hit you in the face with solder and iron <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the, right. Look at all the nails. They got nails in it? Oh, oh that is shit. not, that is that not, not a handle. That's not sturdy Somebody at all. Somebody put that on there. This is not a handle. Oh, those are tire plugs. Right there. Look, Drake, I'm a job. Bush oh. lattes. Oh, boy. <laughs> Miller Lite Cowboy. He must have been thirsty. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. Well, I put my concrete cologne on this morning, so we should be good to go. Looks like the water tank is about full, so uh, we'll see you guys down on the job site. Take a steak, center of each one. I think that'll be good. Now you don't put a screw in there. Yeah. On the, yeah. yeah. Don't put a screw on yeah. the inside once we got to move it out. You're going to be able to get it out. <laughs> just kidding, got you. You guys are paying attention to <laughs> so You don't need a screw there. Just hold that steak nope. like that. Yeah, once it's filled up with concrete, we'll pull that steak out of the middle because the concrete. Yeah. Victory style. Yeah, yeah. Got you. And we got about 
What do you think that is, about seven yards? I think so. Yeah. Better call for a full set. Yeah, and then we'll take the rest out there and do our manhole. Pull all the way around. All the way. This is going to be nice. We should have just formed up our own manhole, maybe. Yeah, that would have been nice. Yeah, it's been easier. Concrete calculator. Handy man calculator. You got an app downloaded then? Yeah. Wow. Does it convert inches into feet too? Point six five. Point six five. So what are you gonna order? A yard? Yeah. Take the risk of the plant. Yeah, well I'll put that ditching bucket on there. Fill it up and drive across town. <laughs> it's got two holes in the bottom. We ain't rotate. Yeah, good. All right. Hey. Concrete's here.
Doing a couple dress ups, clean ups, Organic. organics. While we're waiting on our concrete, we did. We're just kind of going around and finding some jobs that need to uh, cleaned up. Zach's retiring. Zach's retiring his last days. What is today? Wednesday? Yep. Last day's Friday already. He, four. What five months was way too much. Yep. So bye Zach. Yeah. Bye Zach. This sucks. You're still here. Yeah, we'll go record some of his jobs one of these days. <laughs> I think there's some curb missing here we'll have to deal with. No, I think it's fine. It's on the other side. We didn't yeah. do nothing. Yeah, we didn't do anything do anything over there. That curb is messed up. Historical roads. Yeah, these are rhetorical roads with these bricks. These roads were put in 1740. They were put in by the people in this town. These roads were built before Columbus came over here in the Santa Maria. Yeah, 1762. 1762. It was May. I think it was raining that yeah. day. So this is several weeks later uh, we come back to take a look see how this was turning out it's the grass sprouts. is filling in huh it yeah does it? Just little. straw is real thick isn't it yeah yeah it'll fill in I don't know I should have uh, probably drug that broom over it a couple more times I guess get that that chatter out of it I don't know you think uh, think I did that too soon or too late or what causes a broom to chatter like that let me know down there we don't do this stuff every day but we try to try to do the best we can on what we do so looks a lot better than gravel I'll tell you that